so sweet anymore. Guess this back job will all try and try now. Bad dreams don't seem so bad anymore. Guess this back job will all try and try now.
Hudson's 118, this is a Lotus at Lan, a yellow one, this is Roger Hudson at the controls, and Roger sharing this car with his wife, Joe's original competition at a Lan, which is a hill climb and sprint, and the Lan is no match for the, uh, the Tracy yeah. car look-alike, they should be driving this weekend, but they developed a, that has developed a bit of a terminal engine problem, but there we go, Keith come down there to Archie Kane, he's breaking down very hard, gets into the next gear, second down at race control, down by the start line, Mary and Milton Omar, please make your way down to the start line uh, where your daughter is being well looked after and is probably sizing a car up ready to have a drive in the next one up the hill. Well, so it's the Delta E4 Coupe out on track, the electric car, and as I said, let's just be quiet for a moment. This man is on an ultimate mission, and the mission is can he improve on his previous best time, which was stunning at the time of all that, was just also very good indeed. A, a car like that doing sub 40 seconds is just madness, absolutely madness. John is the man at the controls of that car, and if anybody can, he can. He loves his motorsport as car 65 sets off. So, 65, that is uh, James Wheeler and it's a uh, 1990 Alfa Romeo NZ. James is the honorary chairman of the Alfa Romeo Owners Club. He's obviously very, very passionate about his Alfa Romeo. Trying it really hard here to set a good time, but it looks a little below through the chicane, to be fair. That number 65, his uh, previous best lap time was only 47.7, so Right then, here's Matt's competition. We've got an Escort Cosworth there. Classic um, Mark II Escort. Um, obviously not, not running the old 1.6 engine, I'm sure. Um, uh, Patron. Here's his uh, RX-7 with the um, Chevy 5.7 V8 under the hood. Getting the tyre pressures just right there. And a um, thing that's very similar to Radical, I can't remember what it's actually called, an AE racing or something like that. But uh, it's a racing car. Um, Sirocco and another classic car. The car's fully road legal, number plates and everything. AP rating, 